<laughs> All right, before Small Business Saturday, there was, of course, Black Thursday, even Black Friday shopping, and that had one Oceanside man so upset that he took it upon himself to go out and heckle people. News 8's Shannon Handy joins us live in Kearney Mesa with the video he made and the national attention he's getting. Shannon. That's right, Alicia and Phil, you know, Mark Dice is very critical of people who waited hours in line to get into big box stores like Walmart. In fact, he used a megaphone and found a creative way to make sure his voice was heard. Look at you zombies lined up for your Chinese slave goods when you have thousands of dollars in credit card debt. Way to buy things that you don't need with money you don't have, morons. Mark Dice, heard here in this video, makes no apologies for heckling shoppers Thanksgiving night. You are so ignorant, you brain-dead zombies! I see a lot of people criticizing it, so I decided it would be better to just go out and shame these people right to their faces. Dice, an author and self-proclaimed media analyst, lives in Oceanside. He spent Thursday and Friday morning yelling at people outside stores in North County like Best Buy and Sears. Look at you slaves lined up for your Chinese goods. How many thousands of dollars of credit card debt do you all have? As of Saturday afternoon, the video he made already had more than 85,000 views on YouTube. It's also been picked up by the Drudge Report and CNN. Despite how popular his tirade has become and the support it's generated online, many are criticizing his approach. You think he was over the top? Definitely. Definitely over the top. We show the clip to shoppers outside Target in Claremont. It's zombies like you. And asked what they thought. As far as that guy, I don't know. I disagree with that. He must have some issues within himself, and he's expressing it out in other ways, I guess. It's rude. It's rude. Dice doesn't see it that way. Do you think you're crossing the line and being too rude? No, I, I think that it's sometimes the truth hurts. The truth, he says, is that consumers are ruining the Thanksgiving holiday for retail workers. Some people say, oh, they should be thankful that these retail workers have a job. That's like slapping them in the face and then telling them that they should be glad you didn't punch them. And when asked if he thinks this type of pandemonium is actually boosting the economy? I literally got squished. His theory is, it can wait. These shoppers can wait until the next day, the weekend. There's well more than a month before Christmas. Now, earlier today, I did interview the marketing chair at San Diego State about this video, as well as his thoughts on the shopping frenzy that Black Friday or Black Thursday has created. So coming up new at 630, hear his thoughts on this issue. Back to you guys. Shannon, uh, what type of response did Dice get when he went out and did all this? Well, Alicia, the video is actually more than four minutes long, and in it, I saw people throwing things at him. Of course, people were yelling at him, but in one case, there was actually a couple dozen people in front of the Best Buy in Oceanside that applauded him because they, too, specifically went out there not to shop, but to just watch all the craziness go down. 85,000 hits already. Yeah, already went viral. Yeah. All right, Shannon, Thank thanks you. so much. We'll see you next hour.